Good morning and welcome to my channel. I am the Fat Man and uh, today we're doing a little impromptu four-wheeling. Uh, I got a phone call about 8 o'clock last night. I said, hey, you want to go to Scrubgrass tomorrow? Scrubgrass is one location that I have yet to travel to this year. Uh, it's in Templeton, Pennsylvania. It's about 60 miles north of Pittsburgh and you know what? I didn't have nothing better to do today so as you can see, Jeep is in tow. We're on our way. We should be meeting up with several other members from the Pittsburgh Jeep Club here shortly. And uh, yeah, I'll see you when we get there. everybody we have arrived at Scrubgrass. I'm gonna give you guys a panoramic view of all the Jeeps that made it and then hopefully we can hit the trail here pretty soon. something you need a spotter stop tap you know beep your horn twice because everybody bumps it once more if you you blast your horn twice full line will stop no matter where it's at something's wrong if you need a spotter don't be afraid to ask we'll get out you get you through ideas to get out of here and get home have fun doing it but if you don't want any any accidents any problems um, again stress that a lot ask if you need help ask i'll ask you'll ask and just make sure you ask if you're not comfortable with it if something that's beyond your ability again We'll find another way around it, or we'll walk you through it. Uh, there's plenty of winches here, so we should be able to get everybody out. If you are do not have a winch, just make sure you're between two winches. When you're doing your lineup, you look around. People who have a winch, make sure you stagger each other. If you want a winch per up, one winch, so we can always help each other out. Um, if you haven't aired down, I would recommend it. I went down to 20 personally. The size matters to your preference. Anything else you want to add I went down to tan. You don't have no choice. You go ten no matter what. Go I go ten no matter what. Okay, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, just the two without a winch, just make sure they're in the middle, they're surrounded. Uh, like I said, if you're getting in trouble, blast the horn twice. Because there's times you hit something and everybody bumps the horn once and it's going on. Blast the horn twice, we stop. Uh, anybody, think anybody else? Are we split now?
You're on the hill, dude. I don't know. But uh, ironically, my Jeep's the one that's blocking everybody. All right, Joe. Let's see how well you do there, buddy. <laughs> What do you think of that little descent from the heavens? Fun. Fun? Yeah. Yeah, I got a little crazy. His back wheel's coming up. Oh. Oh. Pucker, pucker, pucker. <laughs> this video shows nothing what this hill really is. Most of these JKs that are coming down right now are definitely losing their uh, back wheels off the ground. They're definitely coming off the ground. What do you think of that roller coaster? Oh, it's good time. Good times? <laughs> Thoughts and opinions? Woo! Woo? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, just hug right. Where are you going? All right, so general rule of thumb is when you're bouncing on a rock, you, you should probably let off. If not, that's what happens. Yay for me. Now I get to try to limp this thing out of the woods. All right, everybody, it is the end of the day. There's just a few of us left here. We are trying to air up, get out of here. As you can see, Jessup's on the trailer, broken drive shaft and everything. Uh, it turned out to be a really good day. Uh, had a really good fun time. Uh, everybody enjoyed themselves. And I was the only casualty, so it is what it is. But uh, thanks for watching, guys, and we'll see you on the next time.